Joining us now to share his insight and perspectives is Dr. Johan Sabarna Mutu, adjunct senior fellow for the Malaysia Studies Program at S. Rajaratnam School of International Studies. Uh, Dr. Johan, a very good morning to you. First of all, uh, morning, yeah. campaigning officially begins today, but as we've seen, the past few weeks have already been so chaotic. We saw big names being dropped from Barisan Nasional. Uh, we saw potential candidates moving to contest different parliamentary seats. How are you making sense of all these developments so far? Well, it's going to be interesting uh, from the perspective of uh, multi corner fights. I mean, this is probably the first election where we see such an array of contestants uh, coming, coming from basically three coalitions. And on top of that, you also have uh, independent groups. You have something called Gera Independent. Uh, you have, uh, you know, somebody like Tian Chua. Uh, we know from today now that he's standing as an independent, even though he was a PKR uh, uh, in Batu, uh, the, the seat uh, which is a very hotly contested seat in, uh, in, in Wilaya. In, in Kuala Lumpur. So you have very, very interesting kind of uh, politics, which I think is rather unprecedented in Malaysia. So, so we are waiting to see the fireworks. <laughs> yeah, indeed, we are looking forward to those fireworks as well, Dr. Johan. Uh, you mentioned earlier multi cornered fights. Apart from that, any other surprising moves or announcements that we should anticipate today? Uh, I think the major sort of contestants, I mean, your your, your correspondents have already mentioned, Tambun, uh, you know, the, the leaders, uh, Anwar has moved there. Uh, and then you have uh, Bira, you have, uh, you know, the uh, current uh, prime minister. Uh, uh, no surprises. And um, we still want to hear about uh, Bagandato, where the president of AMNO is standing, Zahid Hamidi. Uh, that will be a very interesting seat to, to look at uh, because you have a PKR contestant uh, against him, uh, Shamshul, I think Iskandar. Again, I, I, haven't, I haven't seen the nominations yet, but, but I think that should come true. And you also have the son of Tun, Dr. Ismail, uh, Taufik, uh, Taufik uh, Tun Ismail, who will, who will be contesting as a Gara independent candidate against Zahid. So we have some very interesting, uh, you know, uh, seats to watch uh, in this parliamentary uh, uh, side of the, on the parliamentary side of the elections. Mm, and speaking of Zayed, you know, BN has dropped several Amna warlords uh, such as Anwar Musa, Shahidan Qasim, Adam Baba, uh, Tajuddin Abdul Rahman. These are basically individuals who have somewhat been critical of Ahmad Zayed's leadership in the coalition uh, in the past few months. What implications will this have yes. on B BN, given that some of them have already changed camps? Yeah, the, I, I suppose the implications will be the split. I think your, your, your correspondents talked about it. The, the votes, uh, particularly when you're talking about the uh, AMNO and, and, uh, and, and, and its, con and its uh, candidates, uh, they will worry about the fact that the Malay vote will be split at least three ways. Uh, you have, uh, you know, the uh, Bersatu pass, actually four ways. You have pass as well, uh, but pass and, and, the, uh, and PN are together. And then you have, of course, Pakatan uh, Harapan, and you also have Garat, uh, 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 Mahade's party uh, contesting here and there. So there, uh, there is this fragmentation of the Malay vote which is uh, thought to be a factor that will affect AMNO's, uh, AMNO candidates. Now, how it will actually sort of pan out, of course, depends on who the, can who the candidate, candidate is. So, for example, in Arau, uh, you, you mentioned uh, Sh you know, Shahida Qasim, right, who has withdrawn, and he will be standing, and he's obviously a very strong person. Uh, he has been uh, a Menteri Basa of Berlis uh, for, for, for years, and so he'll be standing, uh, you know, with... I, not mistaken, he will be taking a seat under PN, uh, Perikata National. So you're going to see very interesting splits there in terms of how people will vote. And uh, again, I I'm waiting to see <laughs> see see what actually happens. Uh, you know, uh, but but interestingly, the 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 contestations will be more more intense. Let's put it that way.